Almonds are really actually a pretty good example of something that's grown that there's almost no waste with them because there's a use for everything. You know, you get the best almonds go to you know, fresh stuff. The kind of ugly ones are chopped up for trail mix or cooking. And then everything else is made for powder or milk or something like that. Now it's, we've gotten to this point where we can just throw away 10 to 40% of the fruit that you're growing. It's pointless. My name is Ben Moore. I'm a fourth generation farmer from here in Kingsburg, California. I'm the founder of The Ugly Company, and our company exists to prevent food waste and add legitimate value back to our farms. Anybody who's farmed or worked in a packing shed or had anything to do with agriculture has seen all this fruit getting thrown out. Just within a 15 mile radius of where we're sitting right now in Kingsburg, between 1,000 and 2,000 tons of fruit a day gets dumped out. Other than farmers, nobody really sees that. Almost all of that fruit could be consumed by a human being, whether it's fresh or in a processed product. Really, the fundamental root problem of that waste is consumer purchasing patterns. Farmers have to grow the most perfect looking piece of fruit that they can grow, or it won't be sold. When I started The Ugly Company, the main reason I started it was because I see a lot of people making a lot of great effort to solve food waste, to do great things. I don't hear our voice being heard. And what that's led to is a lot of these solutions, they're very well intentioned, but they don't add value back to farms. Our solution is two-pronged. It's we create profitable demand that adds value back to farmers for products made from ugly fruit that would have gone to waste. Right now we have a dried fruit product out there that one four ounce bag of that prevents over two pounds of fruit from being thrown out. The only difference between the fruit that goes in our dried fruit versus the fruit that ends up in the supermarket is the fact that it's ugly. A lot of it, you look at it and you go, well, you know, this could go, be in the store, but it'll have a little nick on it or, or a soft spot or it, maybe it's the wrong size. The majority of it is, is cosmetic issues or marketplace conditions that create most of that waste. You know this ground because we've been on it our whole life. Right. We're not going to add more water to the trees than we need. We're not going to spray more than is needed to be sprayed. But you get a you know, huge operation that has 10,000 acres. They don't know that as well, and they're not as efficient with the land, and it doesn't mean the same doesn't have the same value to them. People are so disconnected from farming nowadays that that's why I think there's so much food waste. My grandma, she, she would come out after they would pick and she would find something to make out of everything that was left over. Make, you know, make more raisins, make more dried fruit, dry them on the roof, you know, make juice out of it, store everything, make pies. My dad used to have a saying that they used during the depression. It was use it up, wear it out, make it do or do without. That was what they lived by. My grandpa said it forever, my dad said it forever, and I also believe it as well, that farmers are the original environmentalists. Our life is so dependent on the land that the goal for us is to take that land, you know, to grow it, and then pass that down to the generations. But that's one thing I want the ugly company to stand for is, is just to show who we are, knowing what that's like to wake up every day and, and farm. Our goal is that no food is wasted at farms worldwide. When that happens, we're done. <laughs>